Hey guys, Ayana the Hair Razor here. So I'm really excited about this video that I am recording today. Um, I'm excited because usually um, on YouTube and IGTV or whatnot, I'm talking to the, uh, I guess the customer, the client. Um, in most cases, I am a hairstylist. I am a licensed cosmetologist. So I'm usually talking to the client showing the client different tips and tricks on how to maintain their hair at home showing the client different things but today i want to talk to the hairstylist um, one of the things that i've always wanted to do was help other hairstylists and i'm really kind of focusing my business more on that or i won't say my business but just everything on that um i am retired in a way right now um i just had a baby 18 months ago you guys a lot of you guys know that some people don't so i made a decision to step away from behind the chair uh to you know be at home with her and whatnot uh we are also going through a transition where she is now in school and now i'm able to expand and focus on my brand and my business but anyway that's my backstory um i have been in the hair industry in the beauty industry since i was 15. i am 33 so woo, it's been a while uh but since i was 15 and i was an assistant i became a licensed cosmetologist out uh, after high school after I went to cosmetology school and all of that so I've always loved this I remember cutting my Barbie dolls hair all that type of stuff um, so I, I've loved this for a long time and um, I've seen the ins and outs of the industry I've see, seen the industry as an assistant I've seen the industry as a hairstylist I've seen the industry as a client you know we were all clients before we became hairstylists so um, yeah I, and I it's so many things that I see that I'm like, oh my gosh, like, oh, I wanna help, or, oh girl, I don't know about that. So, I'm taking that step out and I'm here to help you, the hairstylist, because I believe that everyone should be excellent in their business. I believe that everyone should be amazing at what they do. I believe that everybody should be booked on booked on booked on booked at all times. Like, there is no slow days. When I was a hairstylist, I was like, I always said, I have no slow days. I have no slow months. And guess what? I was booked. So I want to share, you know, different tips and tricks with you guys. I want to share everything. So let's get it. All right. So my first tip that I want to share with you, the hairstylist that is watching this, is share with your clients. Share with your clients. Um, I remember when I started doing YouTube videos and sharing tips and tricks for clients, I did it because a lot of my clients were leaving the salon and not knowing what to do with their hair. I have gotten comments about, oh, you're telling all the business and blah, 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 and all of that. And I'm like, okay, yes, I'm telling certain things and yes, I'm sharing certain things, but honestly, it is making your client's hair healthier and better so when they leave the salon and go home and do their thing and then they come back to you they don't have any issues the tips and tricks that i shared are things like hey use a satin pillowcase when you go to sleep use a satin bonnet here are the right products and tools to use for your hair at home so share with your clients if you want your clients to have healthy hair at home and come back to you with healthy hair share with your clients share with them the different tools they need to use at home share with them the different finishing and styling products they need to use i mean even selling those products in the salon get retail and sell those products to them so that they can have the right products to go home with and then you come back don't be afraid to share don't be afraid to share um, don't feel like it's gonna make your pockets empty or whatever no it's not the more you share the more they know that you actually care about them and not just their money it's about them it's about servicing them it's about excellence so share with your clients don't be afraid to share share the tips share the knowledge share everything everything now I'm not saying showing them how to do their own relaxers at home. 
because y'all know if a client is watching this, y'all know how I feel about that. Cuts, chemicals should be done in the salon by a professional that you trust. But I'll get into that later with y'all clients. Um, but yeah, I'm not saying all that. I'm saying the finishings, the, the at-home care, all that type of stuff. Share with your clients. Show them that you care. That's it. Show them that you care. And in honestly, it makes for a better industry. It makes us better stylists. And, you know, all around, it shows that we care, like I said. And I keep saying, I'm going to keep saying with all these tips. It's about how much we care. If you care about this industry, if you care about your clients, if you care about, you know, preserving their hair and ha happy, healthy clients and healthy hair, then you'll be willing to share. So I hope you guys take this advice. If you have any questions, comments, whatnot, hit me up in my DMs, hit me up on my email. It's hello at thehairraiser.com. Also check out my website, thehairraiser.com. I'll have more tools and tricks and different things, especially for stylists coming up. And yeah, I wanna connect with you guys. Um, this industry is so big but so small and I believe and I know and I see every day amazing stylists out there and I just want everyone to be better. So love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.